Hi, this is Mark Pizza Keller, and what I want to talk about today is the new working from home deduction provisions. Now, you might say, what's so exciting about that? Well, I don't know if you know this, but during the pandemic, around 5 million Australians claimed working from home deductions using a cents per hour basis. What's changed? Well, some big things have changed. First, firstly, the rate per hour is now 67 cents. That's going to be good news for some people. It covers a lot of different things. It includes things like energy expenses, electricity, gas, etc., phone usage, mobile and home, internet, stationary, computer consumables. Separately, you might be able to claim other deductions, but that's not something I'm going to discuss today. I want to focus on the 67 rate because 67 cent rate because look, this is going to apply from 1 March this year. The biggest change is that you need to record this on a daily basis. And people will say to me, Mark, What's the biggest mistake people are going to make in relation to this? Well, the biggest mistake is this. They're going to look at the year, 365 days, and they're going to you know, reduce it by annual leave and sick leave and come down to a sort of representative period in which they work from home and then multiply by the rate. Well, that's gone out the window. No longer applies. You need to be able to apply the cents per hour method to each day that you worked on a daily basis by the number of hours. Big difference, significant increase in compliance. This applies from 1 March this year. Please, um, if you've got any questions, give me a call, but don't let yourself down and uh, do this later because uh, you should always do it contemporaneously. Speak soon.